Skype because life was too difficult on Zoom. So, oh, snap. yes. So, I want to hide that bar. No, that did not work. Never mind. We're into that. Sorry, still oh, running your controls. I am. But I gotta quickly, I'm gonna quickly feed my horses. Maybe. I don't know. I'll have to see how much hay I have. Ah! Ah, I have no. So, like, literally, Thanksgiving's in, like, three days, almost. Well, I want to three days. Three days from now would be Tuesday. Okay, fine, five days, but still. <laughs> and that it's means not Christmas in a week is, away. Yeah, and then Christmas is around the corner, and I'm like, no, just no. I already bought my sister her Christmas presents. <laughs> the only people I bought Christmas presents for are you and, um, I think I, oh, I bought one for two of our, I have two of our friends done because I bought them posters and I'm like, I'm being cheap on you guys, but you'll enjoy these posters. Yeah, I'm still working on trying to find a Christmas present for you. I mean, in all honesty, anything at Douglas Bean Supply, even if it's a bag of treats. <laughs> I mean, if you want to get me a briar, I would appreciate that. <laughs> but you don't have to. Which I'm just making a mess over here with my snacks. <laughs> I have to make a November. I have to. I still haven't picked up my briar that I'm gonna buy for my November unboxing on my other YouTube channel, Night Briar. Go check it out. I will attempt to link it in the description below. I cannot promise anything as my skills are terrible, but I will be linked in the description below, or I will comment on this video using the Night Briar account, so you can just. Click on it via there. Linking the leaking the account below won't simply do that too hard. Gosh, I cannot speak today. You're you're talking to the one person who literally cannot figure out how to do some stuff on the computer. You're talking to the least like, I'm decently tech savvy, but I'm definitely not very tech savvy. Like, my brother is the most tech savvy. Then it goes my grandpa, ironically. Then it goes my cousin. And then it goes, like, me. <laughs> and then my parents. <laughs> well, I'm pretty tech savvy for the most part. If I tried hard enough, I could probably build a computer, but that'd be interesting. That requires me to like have all the tools. Oh wait, actually hold up. I do have all the tools for that. That requires me to get all the parts for that. Yeah. I bet you could find the parts on in a Black Friday sale. Well, the problem is, the problem isn't the price of the parts. The problem is getting the parts. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I don't it's know. I'm avoiding cool. Black Friday. <laughs> <laughs> We're going Christmas tree shopping instead. And I technically, have my Christmas tree up. I feed at the barn <laughs> because no one else is there that Friday. So, knowing me, I'll wake up. Early, I'll go feed, and then when I go feed in the evening, I'm gonna drag one of my family members out there and be like, "Let me ride. Watch, come watch me ride." Because <laughs> always for me, I can chill out and ride by myself with no one out there. It's great. I know. 
I mean... I mean, is it safe? No, not at all. But I can. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> with the recent stall cleaners right now being terrible and me paying as much as I am for not having good service out there, I might move dancer elsewhere because I'm getting tired of paying $450 a month and not even have... I kid you not, his pasture had not been cleaned in, like, two weeks, it seemed like. Because it filled up two of the biggest wheelbarrows. And Damn. the guys, I swear, the two guys stall cleaning and mucking, literally just pushed the poop behind the trees to make it look like they cleaned. I found poop, like, piled ankle high. And in some place almost calf high. In the trees. In Dance's pen. And I'm like, seriously? Oh, geez, yeah. That's awful. To say, to say I was um, frustrated, angry, many different words for that was an understatement. Because where I'm at, I think I think it's about 500 a month. Not entirely sure. I think I think it's 500 though, 450, 500, probably about the same price you're paying. And stalls are cleaned every single day. Well, yeah, they're supposed to be cleaned every single day here, except for yeah. like one day, and it's not happening. Anyway, you want to meet me at Yorvik Stables? Uh, yeah. Hold on, let me pick out what horse I'm gonna ride. <laughs> okay. While you do that, I'm gonna buy more hay because I need to buy hay because <laughs> I only have twelve hay left, so that's only gonna last me one more day. I mean, like, even as far as I know, stars are even cleaned on holidays. Dang. As far as I know, I've never had to clean on a holiday, but... I mean, I just texted on my Wednesday uh, students earlier saying that I'm not teaching on Wednesday. Because that is my prep day. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm the one that cooks. So I'm like, if y'all want lessons, you're either going to have to reschedule for um, Monday or Friday. <laughs> you're going to work on Black Friday? Unfortunately, that's my salt cleaning day. <laughs> and I already canceled on Kathy once. I, um... I didn't go out yesterday. Oh, why not? Um, so I was supposed to have an all day class on Friday yesterday, but uh, my teacher changed it to the last one on Thursday, and I decided that I just don't want to go out tomorrow. So that's fair. I and want plus, this horse. my legs were dead. I did a lot of squatting and lifting on Thursday because we were doing an all-day extraction. <laughs> so literally, for eight hours, we were pulling people out of cars. Like, just in say, practice? My, yeah. For eight hours. I mean, we had an hour lunch in between, which wasn't too bad. And then we realized there's, like, nowhere for us to sit. So a whole uh, bunch of the guys pulled their trucks around. We had a massive tailgate pizza party in the college's parking lot. Nice. <laughs> okay. I really I want this horse, but I'm going to wait until after Christmas to get him when he's at Fort Pinta. All, all in. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta go. Let my dog outside because she is barking. All right, be right back. Okay. Ow. 
I'm dying here. <laughs> I, I can tell you good. All right, I'm back. <laughs> I was dying there for a sec. You good? Yeah. I tripped over the curtain rod <laughs> that I have in my room from the Fall Fest. Way to go. And I still have, like, a few things left to hang up, so they're laying on my floor as I'm looking at spots of where I want to put them. Because, yeah, I'm trying to make my room not look overcrowded. Because, you know. Yeah, Yeah, um, I need to go through my room and, okay, I know it's going to sound really bad. But I need to get rid of some of the toys that I have in here from when I was little. But I just can't bring myself to do it yet. That's fair. But what ones do you think of getting rid of? I literally have a whole bin that I and never use. I need like a Hot Wheels car maker. How's there a Hot Wheels car maker? What? Oh. A Hot Wheels car maker? A Hot Wheels car maker, yes. How does that work? So, you um you buy the bases of the Hot Wheel, uh, like the wheels and stuff. Mhm. And then you and then uh the Hot Wheels car maker uses a wax and mold to uh do um different like um top shapes for the cars and stuff. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. And you could like mix the colors and stuff. Do like these really cool like tie dye looking cars. Well, I'm someone's knocking. I will be right back. Yeah. I think they don't have house keys. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm coming. I told you I'm in the city. I'm in the city. Yeah, I did. I texted dad. <laughs> <sighs> All right. And I'm back. Hopefully no more interruptions. Um, we'll just maybe edit some of this stuff, maybe. Or not. I don't know. Raw footage is sometimes the funniest. I mean, that is true. Ooh, you riding that horse? I am. I'm riding Hawkeye because I'm ninety percent sure my mom's watching Hawkeye. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna ride Hawkeye. Okay, so this is fun. We were watching Cobra Kai last night, and my mom's like, "What character does this remind you of?" That we like just watched something too, and I'm like, she's like, you know, the Archer guy. I'm like, Hawkeye. She's like, yeah. I'm like. Mom, that looks nothing like Hawkeye from the Avengers. She's like, no, there's another guy named Hawkeye. That's an archer. I'm like, from what movie or show? She's like, oh, show you him and say, I'm like, well, then why are you asking me who it looks like? <laughs> Wait, but. Okay. The only other. There's no other archer called Hawkeye. I'm not even sure if it's an archer, it's just some other character named Hawkeye. <laughs> and I'm like, well, there's what? other characters named Hawkeye, but not another archer. I don't know. The only other art, like superhero archer Hi. that I know is Green Arrow. Hi. <laughs> well, I don't think he's a superhero, it's just like a random person named Hawkeye that was a um, character. I don't know, it, it was funny, because my mom's like, all that, and I'm like, well, how would I know that? Because I don't watch that show <laughs> that you watch. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's weird. Bro, who just said hi? I don't know. I'm guessing it was in global because it's not in state chat. No, no, no. Like physically, I literally just heard someone in my headphones say hi. Oh, my parents brought company over. And they said, oh. hi. 
I didn't think my mic picked that up, <laughs> but I guess it did. Oh, for my star, I thought like Zoe broke into our chat. I'm like, bro, <laughs> why do I hear Zoe all of a sudden? The ghost of Zoe. All... I mean, Zoe doesn't have that kind of hacking skills, right? I don't know. I mean, I don't think she knows I have Skype. Well, considering you just made the account, I don't think so. Well, no, technically I had the account. I just didn't know I had the account. <laughs> oh, well, I had the Microsoft account right. already. Listen, she doesn't know I have Instagram, so. Does Zoe even have Instagram? Can you take her for a walk or take her she out does. or anything? I let her out to go potty a couple times. When I went up for I'm surprised she hasn't found me on Instagram then. I mean, she has Snapchat. She found that. But she hasn't found my Instagram yet. Let's hope she's not going to watch this video and then go search for her Instagrams. Bro, honestly. Ugh. I've got to go deal with people tomorrow. Yeah. By people, I mean the angry people at the grocery store, because I have to get all my stuff for Thanksgiving. <laughs> yeah, I got to do that tomorrow, too. I got to go get salads for my friend's giving tomorrow with my college group, because I've yet to actually get the ingredient, the salad, and I'm like, I'll wait for tomorrow. Bro, you j I literally have to get my whole Thanksgiving list for my whole Thanksgiving meal tomorrow. Oof. Including a turkey. Good luck. I heard turkeys are, there's a turkey shortage this year. There's also a pie crust shortage. Why not just get a pre-made pie? Because I like my homemade pumpkin pie. Fair. I mean, worse comes worse, I can make a pie crust. It's just I don't want to. That's fair. Because that's like a lot of work. I mean, I have to cancel all my kids' lessons on Wednesdays because I'm cooking, so I have to be able to prep. Mm -hmm. And only one of them ever responded. Mm. Well, I wonder if a lot of people are going to be already out of town. Because, well, they're supposed you know, to tell me if they're going out of town. Because if they don't tell me, then it counts as a forfeit and I still get paid. So they're supposed to tell me. Bro, my horse is mm. level four. Nice. I wonder, what's the championship schedule? Mm, Fair of Championship starts in 10 minutes. No, that one have already started. It's Veildale. That starts in 10 minutes. I haven't gotten an alert for that one, though. Oh, no, it starts in 20. Because it's 2040 right now, and it's at 21. Okay. Why do they have to use military time and make my life hard? This is Sweden. Like, I understand that I need to learn military time because of my job. But it's hard, okay? I've been trying for almost a year. It's hard. Yeah. It's one of those things, like, if you're not raised on it, then it's, like, impossible to learn. So instead of where are we going? I was gonna go to the race down at the gate here in Yolohan. So oh. like I know everyone says just like subtract by twelve, but that's math. Well no, I just say from twelve, like from Twelve. Just instead of jumping back to one, 
just keep adding up. So instead of going, you know, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, go 12 o'clock, 13 o'clock. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, no, but, like, if you're trying to figure out, like, the general life's, like, time, then you have, then they're like, oh, just, like, subtract by 12. Subtract? Wouldn't it be add? No, 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 because, like, if it's 13 o'clock, and you're trying to figure out if it's 1 o'clock, subtract by 12, then you're left with 1. So it's 1 o'clock. Oh, I see. Or there's this one girl in my class who's like, I just subtract by two and go off of the last number. So like 13 o'clock, subtract two, that'd be 11 o'clock. The very last number is a one, so it's one o'clock. Which I guess makes sense, but listen, it's still oh, no. I was raised on too both. much work. I was raised on both because, you know, grandpa was in the military, so. Oh, see, I, was I don't know what on... was going on today, but there were like seven different transport planes, military transport planes going by the barn. Maybe they're getting ready for an air show. I don't know. They're the big ones, like the ones that carry the tanks. Hmm. And they were all heading toward Travis. Weird. Oh, isn't, there an air base in, isn't there an air, air base in Travis? Yeah, Travis Air Force Base. But it's no longer an active yeah. military one. Hmm. Anyway, I'm going to go to Moreland now to do those races there. But um, Well, the only other Air Force Base is past in Fort Bragg. Mm-mm. There's McQuellen. Oh, really? I got one all the way out there? Mm -hmm. I know, maybe they're taking them to have, like, maintenance done on them or whatever. Maybe. All I know is I saluted to one of them that was close enough, and they did a wing tip back. And I was happy. They tipped their wing to me, and I was so happy. And my coworker's like, really? I'm like, look, when you go up in the military family, you get a wing tip from a military plane. It's a big deal. Oh, there we go. Build a championship in 15 minutes. Yeah, see, I never really grew up in, like, a military family or whatever. I mean, like, my grandpa was in the military, but he doesn't talk much about it, so. And yet, if I bring one thing up about the Air Force to my grandpa, it's story time. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I mind. I mean, one time when I was making a Christmas, no, it was a birthday present for a friend who was obsessed with military planes. I'm like, Grandpa, tell me everything you know about these planes. Well, actually, now that I think about it, I think both of my grandpas were in the military, but one of them is dead. I think. I yeah. don't know. Regardless, I was not raised on military time. I was raised on simple folk time. <laughs> like I said, I was raised on both. It depended on what we were doing. Hmm, I'm debating about making it lighter in my game. As the sun's setting in my game. Although I do like how my horse glows. Let's see. Oh, so I decided I'm no longer going to do barrel racing on Dancer. I'm going to do something better. Is he liking it too much? No, it's not that. He just doesn't really have the turning power for it yet. But I'm going to do something I think he'll enjoy a lot better. I'm going to do endurance riding on him. Yeah, what is with everyone I'm wanting to do endurance riding lately? It's fun! It's like trail riding! It's 
And also because I've been doing challenges where I have to ride certain miles. And it's fun. Like one of one of the girls at the stable, she wanted to buy one of the horses that um the stable owner's gonna sell for because she wants mm -hmm. to do endurance riding. But long story short, she's not buying the horse. There's this whole thing with the bed and the horse's leg or whatever. Anyways, long story short, she's not buying the horse anymore. But that's sad. Stable owner found someone else to buy someone else that's gonna that will possibly end up buying the horse. And she was telling me about her today and about how the horse that she currently owns, this uh 15-3 painted quarter horse. He's 15 Ooh. years old, but he's just not um he's not because he's not young as he used to be. He's starting to slow down a little, but he's pretty mellow and laid back. But she's trying to do endurance riding, but doesn't have the, the, the horse won't do it. The horse right. isn't really meant for endurance riding for the most part. So she's looking for a new horse and she wants to get rid of her current horse. So mm. she's going to, I guess she's coming out to the stable tomorrow or whatever to meet with the stable owner and the new horse. And she was talking to the stable owner about bringing her current horse out because they might um, end up like doing a trade. For the uh, stable owner of my stable will take some of the money off of how much she's going to sell her horse for. And um, the um, and the uh, potential new owner will give Kathy her horse to use as a lesson horse because we need another lesson horse. Yeah. And I mean, it's a what it, it, he's trained Western. And Western horses are pretty bomb proof, so that's nice. Yeah. Oh, um, only thing is, though. Go ahead. Oh, the only thing is, though, that um, because he's trained Western, we have to train him English. <laughs> That's not that hard. Yeah, it's not too bad, but it'll probably be a few weeks or so before we can use him for lessons. And we really need a lesson horse, like, right now, not, like, a few months from now. <laughs> That's fair. But, um, Ace is up for sale, possibly. My sale horse, Ace. Oh. The owner says he can't ride him as much as he needs to be ridden, so he keeps basically bucking him off because Ace has, you know, Ace is a six-year-old horse with a lot of energy. Oh, can't, yeah. He can't, he can't sit for two months and then, you know, you get on him expecting to, you know, just behave himself. Yeah. So, obviously, I can't afford him. I mean, I could afford the price, but it's not the um, board and everything else. But one of my uh, friends keep. is looking into him. One of my friends is looking into him, and she's like, if I buy him, then when you come and visit me, you can come ride him. I'm like, yay! <laughs> Yeah. See, that, yeah. I mean, the guy was gonna. The guy was. He's like, I'll give you a deal, because I'd also been talking to to him about horse trailers. He's like, I'll give you Ace in the trailer for twenty thousand total. I'm like, huh, that'd be a good deal if I could afford that, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was a nice trailer, too. And I'm like, sorry, I just can't afford that moment with all the, you know, price of everything else. And he's like, I understand. And then, yeah, like, well, plus, I don't really like, have a truck to pull it. And he's like, oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. Well, because, like, because he knows about the accident, I, you know, messaged him about it. Yeah, I don't know. My, um, my, one well, of my teachers from high school was trying to convince me a few weeks ago to go, um, and, um, on this horse that she wanted to buy. And, like, it's not like I can't afford afford to buy a horse I, I i could depending on the horse mm -hmm. my problem is i can't afford the upkeep of the horse yeah i mean once i get more income then i could possibly get a second horse because here's the thing ace was gonna be for my mom it was gonna be fun like he was gonna be my show horse but primarily mom's horse so like i was gonna ride him 
whenever she couldn't, as well as riding dancer. Just, you know, keep Ace exercised, and then whenever my mom wanted to ride, she was going to ride Ace. But like, if I ever came out to ride with you, then we could both ride together. Mm-hmm. I would put you on dancer. Well, yeah. <laughs> Not Ace, because <laughs> Ace is a fireball. Bro, so was Delilah when I started riding her. So every time I get on Delilah, she turned into a fucking fucking Bronco. <laughs> Let's just say that problem had to be fixed quick. <laughs> yeah, she's better now, but she's still a very reactive mare. Yeah, most mayors are. But they're like, because I guess you probably already gone. But she had an incident with, like, while cinching up, they had already put the bridle on, and the reins fell over her head, and she pulled back and tripped in the reins and got all caught up and flipped over. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I wasn't there for that, but it, I heard it was, um, Patty C's fault. <laughs> One of the trainers that buddy fired. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, but that that yeah, I'm about to say that, that I could think of two people where that could have happened, and that was one of the people I was thinking about. Of curiosity, who would the effort one be? Chloe. Yeah, true. <laughs> I mean, I would I, I would say um I would say Zoe, but she's not there, so. Nor is she qualified to be a trainer. No. Gosh, if Buddy ever hired her as a trainer, I'm, I'd be like, I'm out. Bye. Pace. Yeah, I mean, as it is... What? I'm, like, the third most experienced trainer behind, like, Amanda and Buddy. And I'm, like, and I don't know that much about training people. I can train horses. Can't train people. <laughs> it's not that I don't know how to train people. It's that they don't like to listen to me. Because they're, like, they're, like, you're so short and small. And I'm, like, and, yeah, I can outride you guys any day because I have a half thoroughbred. Yeah, well, that's just logistics. But, yeah, yeah no, I know I, well, I see where you're coming from. Brookie outranks me, obviously, in English riding. But Western riding, I'm... Like, Western riding, I outrank Brookie. In English riding, Brookie outranks me. Yeah. And Brookie doesn't really teach many lessons. She more of just gives pointers while riding Maggie. I mean, you know, whatever works, right? Mm-hmm. But I hope one day my students will be good enough where I can, like, ride Dancer during their lesson and, like, show them what I want them to do on Dancer. Yeah. Hmm. I was laughing with one of my coworkers. I'm like, but they don't have endurance bareback riding. I mean, you know, like, I'm not sure if that's in regulation, but I would do it. It depends on the horse for me. On dancer, I would do it. I'm going to head to the Vodel Championship. Hopefully I didn't miss it. I don't think I did. No, because I just saw a message pop up in the corner of my screen a few minutes ago and said 10 minutes left, so I think you should be fine. Yeah, so I have I have like five minutes. Oh, yeah. I'm trail riding in um, uh, Dundle. You should come join me at the championship. It gets your horse 200 XP. 
Yeah, I'm trying writing a dundle. Yeah, see, like the horse okay. that I currently writing. Oh, have you lessons... finished? Have you finished your quest yet? Because I know you finished the Zappy Apple race. Have you com done any more of the quest? No, I haven't really. I've been on maybe two times since um since I finished the Zap Apple race. You're going to love the quests um, once you can talk to Mrs. Holdsworth in Fort Maria Library. The lore is, like, amazing. Like, I'm like, whoever wrote this lore is, like, my hero right now. Like, I know it's not the original Star Stable lore, but it's still really good. And also, um, I will be going into Devil's Gap next week, possibly. Fun so times. You you might want to um do that quest as but as fast as you can, so you can get into Devil's Gap with me. Because I'm like ninety percent sure we're going into Devil's Gap because we're facing the Bala next week, and the Bala have sealed themselves in the Gap. Spoil it for mm -hmm. anyone. But yeah, the Vala are in, in the gap. One minute left. Dang! That five minutes went fast. Faster than I thought. But you know, I mean, the horse I'm currently riding my lessons, I would, I, w I, I would do bareback endurance on her. But let me tell you, though, I miss my Western saddle so much. You know, I was so happy to ride in it again today. <laughs> and that was the most forward I've ever felt that horse go since I started riding her. Wow. Because I've ridden her English. I've ridden her bareback. The only, the only time I felt her be that forward when I was riding her was when we were heading straight for a jump. Because this horse loves to jump. Mm -hmm. Although, let me tell you, I look so stupid because I was wearing English spurs <laughs> with my whole, like, West, my Western boot, with my Western saddle and everything, then, like, English spurs. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it looked kind of stupid, but. I mean, you do what you gotta do. The only way you can get that horse to go forward is spurs. <laughs> Which kind of sucks, but... Like you said, you do what you gotta do. I'm just glad I don't have to use spurs on Dancer. But I don't want to. And I'm okay at using the bit with him. Like, I'm... It's not my favorite. I would definitely prefer to ride him in a hackamore. But I understood, like, for bill racing, I needed precision control. I was not going to get that. Yeah, until, like, he learned the pattern and stuff. Because there are some oh, barrel racers no, he, that do. Um... He learned the pattern really quickly. It was rating the turn that he had to learn. <laughs> and slowing down to not oh. blow our turn. <laughs> He we learned the pattern very you're quick. A part thoroughbred. That's yeah. That's what he thought. He's like, I can just speed by these, and I'm like, nope. We actually have to turn. I cannot believe that worked. I jumped like through the logs. I have no clue how that worked. Like I just phased through them. <laughs> I'm currently in seventh. That's the best I've done so far in this race. The Veil of Championship is so hard. Okay, wait, can you hear my music in the background? I don't think so, because I, I, I have Star Stables music going. 
Oh, okay. And sounds. Okay, I don't think so because my because it's not connected to my full computer audio, just my headphones. So. But when you're done with the race, I sent you a picture of Western Purdy. Ah, no, I'm stuck on a rock. And I've dropped to 11th. All because I got stuck on a stupid rock. Oh, now I'm in 10th. At least let me get in 9th. At least let me get in 9th, please. I'm not going to. This person's fast. Oh, well. Oh, cute. I'm not going to lie. I was not sure I was going to fit in my Western saddle. I just barely fit. Barely. Probably should get a new one, but... I don't oh I I don't currently own a horse in which I need to buy a new western saddle. Right. Once I have my own horse, then I'll probably buy a new western saddle, but I don't use I don't ride western enough to buy a new one. Yeah. I mean, do you want your old one back? <laughs> I still can't sell that darn thing. Seriously? Seriously. Damn. I honestly thought by now you would have been able to get rid of it. Nope, the only thing I've gotten rid of is the breast collar. A few people have almost bought it. There was one person I was going to buy, but I didn't trust him to actually give me the money. Yeah, that makes sense. Especially when his bar was like, he doesn't have that kind of money right now. I'm like, okay. I wasn't going to accept it. A payment plan from him knowing that he was not gonna, you know. Okay. Mm hmm I mean, that's pretty fat valid, though, so. Plus, the guy already had, like, five saddles from buying his own horse. So, I'm like, you don't need another saddle. Yeah. You should do Drew with training. I'm gonna go finish my damn quest. Oh, yay! Listen, okay, I'm getting. I, I'm trying to get priority straight. Drew with training though is not my priority list, so. But Ruin Runner. Like, oh. I think the Secret Stone Circle, but don't quote me on that. Yeah, hold on. I think that's where I left off. I don't remember, though, so we're going to go find out.
Bro, where's Fripp? Oh, haha. You haven't seen the updated look, have you? I mean, I've seen pictures of it, but no, seriously, my Fripp is missing. Oh, yeah, because he's faded, duh. You'll have, um, you'll find out in a minute. <laughs> Main quest. Hold on, where am I going? Miller's Highland. I went the total opposite direction of where I was supposed to go. <coughs> go out. Miller's Highland. Oh, that's right, because I was talking to Yidris. Okay, I need to stop eating these. <laughs> I've eaten, like, half a bag of Starburst Minis. My goodness. Moving, moving on to my goldfish. Listen, okay, snacks and gaming, they go hand in hand. They do. South Cook Peninsula, my goodness. Where am I supposed to go? Um, there's no way. Oh, wait, I need to be inside the tent. Oh, you're like, there's no way here. Eh. Or, see what happens when I leave off on something in the middle of a quest and I don't remember, like, three weeks later where to go. Yeah. That's why I prefer to do them as close as back to back as I can. Or I'll like watch other people do them if I don't remember. Let's see here. Which option should I do, A or B? What are the options? Maybe we can't to convince him but someone else might or we could try the clock thing again hmm. I don't remember which one I did but do the clock one I think it's funny
Oh, apparently we're fascinated with the measurement of time. <laughs> we humans. I mean, I guess technically we are human and he's um, Pandorian. Yeah. Bro, I have to go all the way back to the Secret Stone Circle. Just trailer. That's some money. Or call. No, wait. Where are you at? Miller's Highland. I was going to say call for pickup and then, you know. So, but that's not much difference. No. I think Miller's Highland is closer than Moreland. Not by much, though, but that's fine. No, dang it, you. Oh, I didn't mean to hit the machine, dang it. Oh, my remote is really warm. I had it sitting on the top of my computer. Which isn't that warm, so why is my remote super warm? Probably shouldn't keep my remote on top of my computer. I might melt the battery. <laughs> and I just found my remote. That's not good. I was convinced someone stole it. For like the last two months, I haven't been able to find it. I was convinced my sister took it. So every single time I'd go use my TV, I had to manually hit the power button. But I hooked up my wireless controller to it, and I could control everything on my TV except for my volume with that. And then I found it. It was under my dog's bed. <laughs> it was the one place I didn't look. Well, yeah, because why would you look under your dog's bed? No, I should have known better. My dog's a boxer. She likes to stuff things under couch. Under everything. Put my favorite t-shirt under there, too. <laughs> Who's so close to level 14? I mean, all my animals like to take and hide my things. <laughs> Fargo will take your things and, like, drag them under a bed or something and hide them. He's weird. A little stuff things under the couch or dog bed, anything she can. The only animals in my house that don't take my things and hide them are the guinea pigs. Because they're in a cage, so I don't think they could. Yeah. Anyway, the Barnabas' race track championship is next. I wonder if by the end of Smack get this horse at level fourteen. She's almost Maybe. level fifteen. She's I mean level fifteen. She's almost level fourteen. I wonder if I can get all the way up maxed up. That'd be nice. Go ahead, try.
not gonna lie, I want this outfit that I have on my character in real life. Like, I would wear this. Have you um, done the refurbishments to the racetrack yet? Have I done what? Uh, the refurb the um, renovations to the racetrack yet? You mean it looks so nice and pretty? Yes. <laughs> I always find it so funny when I go on my alt account and I go to the racetrack on occasion and I'm like, oh, yeah, I forgot. It looks like a total mess on this account. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, like, I love this I, option. I'm going to take pretty pictures. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I love this option. Frip is more important than your drama. I mean, he, you're not wrong. Well, Avalon's mad that, um, you know, we've got uterus. Yeah, I think I remember saying that to them. When isn't Avalon mad about something? I mean, honestly. Because we're not doing it the um, pure druid way. <laughs> if it was up to him, I mean, his brother would still be in Pandora. I mean, yeah. Level 14. Let's see if I can get this horse up to level 15. Ten minutes until the barn misses championship. I love the sound effects they have. Like, if you don't fully clear the head jump, it makes the rustling of leaf sounds. Yeah. And if you don't fully clear the water jump, it makes a splashing sound. And I love that. Bro, wait. Since when is Granny here magical? She's always been a witch. Wait, Mrs. Holdsworth? Yeah. Don't you remember? Oh, never mind. You didn't do the Halloween update. Like, last year's. Bro. We found out last year in the Halloween Ooh. update. You know, I'm finding out all sorts of new stuff now. Bro. What? They're putting damn pronouns in this game. Mm. Oh no, someone literally has their horse named Blind Squirtle. I mean... <laughs> and then Mousy. Because, um... <laughs> Mousy. Because I remember when these characters used to refer to, like, me, and it'd be all like, well, has anyone asked her how she feels about this? And now they're all like, has yeah. anyone asked her how they feel about this? Like, bro. It's because the boy's playing the game. Not ever. They're playing as female characters. Just gonna put that out there. Mm-hmm. Like, when I used to play Call of Duty, I had to be a male character. But, you know, I just tend to ignore it and be like, whatever.
Wait, where did Anne go? I'm so lost. She stole the clover. Or she's going to. Well, it said that the clover is gone and Anne is missing. Yeah, she took the four-leaf clover. Five Long story short, she's... She, five-leaf, okay, fine. She took the five-leaf clover because she was to um, speed up Concord's aging. Doesn't do it. But, yeah, spoiler. I like how now the map tells you where your horse is. Yeah. There's been many of times where I've lost my horse in this game. Okay. These guys are having too much fun. Rip, your toe doesn't fit under your blanket. It's too bushy. You look quite dead. His mouth is open. <laughs> This is funny. So it's, um, you know the flight guys that, um, do the, um, thing to, like, allow you to, they do the thing with the, um, to d guide the planes out? Yeah. With the glow sticks? What are you using the glow sticks as lightsabers? I mean, I've seen them use those, I've seen them use actual, like, lightsabers for those glow sticks. Yeah. I mean, let them have some fun, right? But it's like, blame these guys if your flight's delayed because they're too busy dueling. I mean, you know, if there's no incoming planes, then why not have some fun? Wait, hold up. I think I have that in my damn inventory. What? Pandora's Hope. Isn't that? I think I might have that somewhere. I'm sending you something via Pinterest that I think you will enjoy. Okay, let's see here. Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> I know, right? It's beautiful. <laughs> and so true. I mean, yeah. Especially the Titanic one. <laughs> We're not wrong, because they totally look like he's doing the Titanic. Right? And honestly, the Lion King one is wholesome. Where is... Oh, there it is. Mm. Another gift you could get an idea for Christmas gift slash birthday gift is, you know, money to buy double star coins. <laughs> oh, they up the prices and I'm mad, but I understand why. Because, you know, inflation and um, energy prices and costs and electricity in Sweden is not fun right now. 
Yeah. Bro, who can help us find Pandora's hope? Oh, Nick Stronghold. It's his it's um his fridge. His fridge? Long story. No wonder his fridge fly. As... <laughs> oh, you get to chase it in a minute. Bro, seriously? I haven't done enough crap with that guy. Oh, you haven't gotten enough reputation to do it? What? No, I just said I haven't done enough stuff with that guy to know it well. Hmm. I just hope you have the reputation level that you need for him to do, to finish his quest. Wait, bro, I need a reputation level? You might with him. I don't know. I'm already well, admired go with find him, out. so. <laughs> oh, I'm about to go find out. My horse. There it is. Ooh, you know what we should do? What? We should try to break into the, um, the Ashland and see how it's looking. I tried. I wasn't successful, but I found another place to break in at. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Um, up by the, um, monorail. Oh, there's a place. I ironically, I ironically fell, I ironically fell in. And it didn't hmm. boot me out for quite a while. <laughs> Wait, did you fall into Ashland over there? Mm-mm. That's a different area. Oh. Very pretty. Well, depending on what my reputation's looking like for this guy and whether I can do this or not, we should probably go break in. We do not suggest breaking in people that's not, you know, you could potentially get banned. We don't care, though. We have too much fun. We're trying to get in. Listen, okay, half my fun on this game is trying to break into places I'm not supposed to. I don't think they've actually ever banded anyone I know of for break, you know, going into an unknown place. Yeah. Especially in like my case where it was totally an accident. And then there's me who spent like an myself. hour on purpose. I swear, watch us say I need to be, like, friendly or whatever with this guy. Where am I at with this guy, anyways? It'd be nice if this was, you know, in alphabetical order, but... I know. I wish it was. Well, let's see. I'm friendly with the strong ground exploration. So I 
thinking I, I should be good. We're about to find out. So. Well, at least I'm not coming last. I'm coming second to last, but not last. Ooh, at the bottom of this race, race track, they're playing the fire song. Great. Now I'm chasing a refrigerator. Uh. Bro, what has this game come to?
I'm trying to remember how I safely got down this hill. Maybe this isn't the way. Wait, I where am I going? Way, but then. Oh, I have a refrigerator pet now. Well, momentarily. Am I supposed to be taking this refrigerator back to the secret stone circle? Oh, so uh, now I fall in and don't take a dangerous fall when I'm actually trying to leave. Okay. <laughs> Bro, I think this refrigerator is possessed. Okay, I mean, where am I not taking wrong. this? Um, I think you're taking it over by um. Oh, where is it? Um, the hermit's cottage. No, not the Hermit's Cottage. Shipwreck. Shipwreck Shore. That or the Sunset Islands. It's one of those three. Ha ha ha. I'm in. I'm in. And invisible wall. I think it's first able, they patched it. There's now an invisible wall here. Okay. But look at my screen. There's like this whole beautiful 
valley at, back here. Uh, hold on a second, let me open Skype. Oh, yeah. whoa. Weird. I ran into an invisible wall. <laughs> okay, I'm supposed to be transporting the fridge to the Sunset Isles. Where is that? New Hillcrest. By what Icelandic races? <laughs> it's like all the way across the map. Yep. God, I hate quests like this. Call them for pickup. I'm not. I'm not running all the way there. Wait, where did the fridge go? Mm -hmm. I don't know. We're about to find out. I'm going to go run there. I mean, I'm sure I could get him up to level 15 tonight, but it might take a long time. Yeah. But I mean, it's doable. Yeah, if I have the energy. I'm gonna lighten my game. Make the time of day different. I don't know, my game's just kind of like yellow.
Yeah, I'm gonna go do the horses of your but Grace. Okay, I'll switch up. Bro, that's so round. It is. Oh, I forgot to set the light. When you exit your home stable, it, turn, it resets. Oh, there it is. Yeah. I think it's around for two more weeks. Gosh, now I have to run around the place and collect things. Not that hard. I'm just saying, okay, when you're doing these quests, you're the only one doing it. Like, are you seriously telling me the other sword runners can't help with any of this? Yeah. Oh, what's that? Oh, incoming. They want your pay. They want your pay. Now to switch back to my little horse. I like how we're just like building this ritual circle in the middle of an island. I mean, we gotta do it somewhere, right? <laughs> You might as well do it when no one's going to find you. <laughs> oh. The way I was sitting was hurting my hip. <laughs> God, that made me sound old. Mm. We are old.
<sighs> okay, let's save Frip. Mm. Bro. What? Where did Fripp go? Mm. I don't remember. That was too long ago. You find him yet? Apparently, this is what I've been training for, but I haven't been training. <laughs> Whoops. Well. Eh. Details. <laughs> Honestly. After this race, I'm going to take a quick break and get some more hot water and a snack. Also, name the horse Fox. That's cute. Wait. Someone's name is Gun Dragonfire. Wow. Gun Dragonflower, sorry. With Crash Runner as their horse. That's funny. But I didn't know Gun was a first name for a person. Great. We're going into the in between, into the unknown. Into the unknown! Oh, no, no, you're it's gonna do that. Uh, nah. It's like a song. Come on, you knew I had to do that. You set yourself up oh, for yeah. that. First of all, we're probably working. Um, sure. I'd also like some hot water. Thank you. I think you're kind of reaching a little bit. Yes, yes. You didn't even get the dog out and help us like we well, asked. Yeah. No, I got her out. I let her out potty a few times. But I got home not that long ago. And I was like, you didn't even let the dog out potty. I'm like, yeah, I did. When I got home, I let her out. And then after I showered, I let her back out. 
And even before we start this, you let her out. Mm-hmm. Oh, great. I gotta shut down this portal. Ow! Wait. That hurt. I haven't been training for this. I haven't been training for this. See why druid training is kind of a priority? Listen, okay? Priorities weren't there. Oh, so most horses named Raspberry Faith. That's cute. No. What part am I supposed to shut the shadow seekers or the portal? I have to run into the portal three times in under two minutes. Yes. What? Yeah. It's a crazy challenge. <sighs> right. Yay! I actually came in decent after having a terrible start and like failing that first jump. I came in 10th out of 19 people. There were 20, but one person failed. All right, where you at? Uh, currently in the unknown. Oh, in the stone circle, basically. I'm gonna go to Golden Hills Valley or Golden Leaf Stables.
Gosh, because that was not stressful. Uh -huh. Bro, why are you asking me how to get back in the real world? You're the one that put us here, Linda. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. I forgot Linda was the one who put us there. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Fripp looks like a girl. <laughs> to me, he looks like, you know, an elf. Like, the a fair elf. Like, if you watch, ever watch Lord of the nope. Rings. Looks like a girl squirrel. Looks like a girl squirrel. Eh. It's his eyes. I mean, fair. Wee. And now time for more fun. <laughs> But it's gonna be so long. Oh, that's a new sound. It does like a ring when you miss a checkpoint. Huh. Like if you run out of time because you missed a checkpoint. It does like a kitchen timer sound. Okay, all the way back to the secret stone circle. <laughs> I don't like this running all the way across the map. It's not that bad. Imagine if we had the whole map unlocked. 
10 minutes later, you're across the map. I mean, it'd be fun, though. Yeah, I hope one day we get the full map. That would make me happy. Yeah, one day. What the heck? What? I don't know, there's a lot of banging happening outside. Weird, I don't hear anything. No, we haven't updated our Star Stable Star Wars story in ages. Yeah. I love what Evergrey calls Fripp the cosmic squirrel. Uh, I mean, he's not wrong. I mean, yeah, the cosmic squirrel from space. What? <laughs> hmm. I'm so funny. Oh, nothing. It's just... I don't know. Noise outside. Oh. I thought I heard you laughing. No. Well, I'm up to the H. I'm not sure how much longer I I'm getting a little bored of training. I don't have any quests. Time for dailies. Yeah. I already broke into the one place.
Well, that seems like a hot mess. What? Uterus has the fridge. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, Rip is now home. He is alive. I will finish the rest of that later. Good job. I'm proud of you. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm rescued <laughs> from Hill, and I'm just having fun trying to find different photo places. Yeah, I noticed. Also, love this feature. Oh. <laughs> Bro, we've been doing this for two hours. Oh, gosh. <laughs> anyway, oh. I guess we'll end this podcast, whatever the heck we want to call this thing here. Um, <laughs> so, uh, how do I stop the share? <laughs> eh. Oh, Hold hey, on I stop recording on my end. That's cool. All right, hold on. Let me call for pickup, and I'm going to log out and see if that helps me get back to the main screen, so. Well, you could just press the Windows button on your computer. That too. Uh Haha. Thank you. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um... Hope you enjoyed this random video. If you make it this long, I applaud you with our craziness. So, see y'all. Good night.